Hi everyone, the book that I brought for you today, uh, Fluid, a uh, best uh, seller book in India and it's a very popular book. It debunks the rigid mind. And why this particular book is national seller, there is obvious reason. Uh, this book speaks about uh, the rigidity of human mind and focus on a particular field rather than uh, addressing or learning many fields. And this particular book takes uh, examples of uh, uh, learned uh, celebrities. They were not particularly rigid in their learning. Rather, they were more of a generalist. They learned a lot. A uh, lot of celebrities, Steve Jobs, Leonardo, Leonardo da Vinci, and uh, Sir C.V. Raman, the Nobel Laureate, and it goes on. Charles Darwin. So what this author, particularly this Ashish Jaiswal, uh, talks about in this particular book, you don't have to be uh, rigid in your learning, learning a particular uh, field. You can learn and you have to and you must learn many things apart from your specialization. For example, Leonardo da Vinci. And he's known as a, uh, as a painter and a sculptor. But how many of you know he knows physics very well, he's uh, more of a biologist and you, know, you can rather say that he is a scientist. He has done a lot many things. He constructed uh, uh, weapons and then he, drawn, he has drawn uh, biological uh, diagrams. Even till today uh, these diagrams are kept very well in some of the best universities and beyond that he is also an artist. So. This fluid mind as a human, you know, learning the inclination to learn more of the other fields that will help the human growth. Uh, he speaks about Steve Jobs in one of the uh, chapters where Steve Jobs was not confined to one particular field. Uh, you may all know if you read uh, his autobiography, he read uh, calligraphy and this calligraphy uh, he uh, studied, he learned uh, uh, many years ago. But when he started his company Apple, this calligraphy came in force and because of his learning in calligraphy, this Apple design, the, uh, the font design uh, became outstanding. So he speaks about uh, different celebrities and he highlights the need. For example, Sir C. V. Raman. Sir C. V. Raman is our Nobel Laureate, an Indian Nobel Laureate and Rabindranath Thakur. Let me speak about Sir C. V. Sir C. V. Raman. Sir C. V. Raman, we all know. He is a Nobel Laureate, he is a scientist. But how many of you know he has written a beautiful article on music and music instruments? You know, where is a scientist and where is somebody who is writing an article about musical instrument? And that was uh, Sir C. V. Raman. Similarly, Charles Darwin. Charles Darwin's father was a, a celebrated uh, physician. His, even his grandfather was a celebrated physician. His brother was a physician but Charles Darwin was not interested to become a physician rather his interest went to many fields and that is how Charles Darwin became one of the uh, greatest uh, uh, scientists of the world. So this uh, Ashish Jaiswal uh, speaks about the mind being fluid and the inclination and willingness to learn not only arts, the art, the art person can never be confined to art or nor the science person can never be confined to science. They can always uh, cross over and learn many things. I recall uh, in one of the uh, one of the YouTubes, uh, Albert Einstein. Albert Einstein is a great uh, scientist, but how many of us know that he is a violinist? Albert Einstein, whenever you know he experiments, whenever he struts, he I mean he has problem with uh, some of. Um, is finding he immediately goes and takes his violin and he plays so what a wonderful fusion of science and art that is what uh, Jay Swal uh, speaks about and he also gives reference of Indian uh, scripts and in India we earlier to many thousands years before Indians believed in this fluidity fluid mind and learning uh, different things that again uh, Jay Swal mentions in this particular book and this book wherever you go uh, any library or any bookstore, you would definitely find this book. I just picked up uh, last month and found this book is very good. I'm sure you would love this book. If you like this uh, channel, please uh, subscribe this. 
like this uh, channel and uh, please mention on the comment section what do you think about this particular review thank you so much